Okay. Yes. So it is now recording. Our lesson is about useful email phrases. Yeah, everyone uses emails. E1, how often yeah. do you use or write an email? Greetings. Greetings, yes. Hello there. Hello there. Oh. Yeah, opening lines, as we call that, greetings. I'm going to teach you also about greetings to be much more socialized and engage to the person whom you're going to send your message. Okay, so Ewan? Yeah. Do you write an email every day? Uh, not every day. Ah, uh, okay. So how often? <laughs> oh, actually, I really write emails. Uh, okay, I see. <laughs> well, I just want to also to tell you that when we are using actually word, this is for to disrupt the other speaker's opinion. Yeah, if it's contrasting to the opinion, you're going to use actually. If it's, you are just going to add some opinions, you have to tell another areas of transitions. That is you called smart transition. Yes. If you're going to take a look smart transitional words and search on the internet, you will find a lot of transitional words to be more fluent in your spoken English and also to your writing and emails. I'll give you some kind of ballpark figure. Let's say, Transition. for example, however, yes. Therefore, in conclusion, in contrast, if it's contradict to the opinion, and what else? On the other hand, yes. Actually, also, uh, of course. In oh, we don't in say order. Actually. What is it? Yes, in, in order. order. Yeah. Well, I will send you this link because this is very interesting. Oh, please turn off that. Uh, please try to mute everyone so that it's not echoing to my, my side. Okay. Transitional. Transitional words. Okay, here you go. Transitional. Transitional word. Yes. I would like to give you transitional words phrases before we begin into the smart, useful English phrases. Yeah, it's very interesting and you're gonna learn a lot of this. Okay, good evening to you, Buhari, and also everyone. Okay, so I would like if it's okay. Ayesha, could you read this one? Yeah, what is transitional words? Only this. I would like to hear your voice because I haven't heard your voice before. Yeah. Can you read? Okay, maybe my voice is pretty late. <laughs> so she cannot really hear. Hello, Aisha. Are Hello. you there? Hi, good Thanks. evening to you and nice meeting you also. It's my first time to hear your voice. So I would like you to read. If it's okay for us. Okay, thank you. Yeah, great. Fast speak. <laughs> okay. Parts so. of speech transitions, words. Yeah. So are you, are used to link words, phrases, or senses. Yeah, just read uh, this because we would like to hear your voice. Mm. Okay. Where? Yeah, here, this one, they. Oh, okay, okay, okay. They help the reader to progress from one idea expressed by the author to the next idea. To, they help to build up, uh, how to say it? Yes, coherent. 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 Co relation, re relationships 
within the text. Okay, it's thank you so written. much. Aisha, please say it again. The, thus, with vibration. TH sound has to... Dash, dash. Yeah. Thus, 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 you can thus, point your thus, yeah fingers thus, your throat. Thus, okay, thus, so that's thus, all. Uh, of course, you can study this to uh, your own comfort areas. I just want to give you some of the free phase so that you could start using your transitional words. Yeah, the first part we have to understand is the agreement. If you are spelling or saying the agreements. You will be adding, as a matter of fact, yeah. Instead saying, actually, we don't say that. Yeah, we need to use, as a matter of fact, like that. Yeah. In addition, like this. Okay, Iwan? Yeah. You can flip your actually words if it's not contradicting of what I'm saying. Because you're mm. transition, usually it's a bridge to connect one sentence to another sentence. That's why you are reuniting it and collide together to use a concrete sentence. That's why the actually word is improper usage when we are using that and when we overdo this word. So instead, please use as a matter of fact, or in addition, oh, like that, that's much addition. more formal. Yeah, as a matter of fact, it's like much more casual, just like now. Yeah. And you can choose if it's additional, just choose a transitional word similarity. Yeah. Uh, I have a good day. And you could say likewise. Yeah, like that. Likewise. You don't need to say good morning too. Yeah. Okay. Likewise. Likewise. It means same as me. Yeah. Oh, yes. Yes, likewise. Okay. And similarity, you can also use furthermore. Yeah. Don't use, which is not really common because somehow for non-native English speakers or for native speakers, they cannot get it. <laughs> yes. Use just only what you know and what you understand. Yeah, and easier to memorize also because you're not just going to see, you have to remember these expressions. Only at least one to two will be perfect. Yeah. And if it's opposition, yeah, you have to say actually. Where's the actually here? I guess, yeah, it's not in here, but it's also included. In contrast, yes. yeah, in contrast, you may use that. On the contrary, yeah. And in reality, if it's too real for you and uh, other areas, just look at here, limitations, if you would like to tell a limitation, contradiction, if the conversation contradict each other, yeah, you can say nevertheless, yeah. Otherwise, however, yes. In your writing, it is much more fluent if you use transitional words. Yes, that's right. Even the checkers, when you are doing some essays at school or anywhere, transitions is really important for us <laughs> to develop. Okay, so let me just send it to you, this part. Excuse me. I will send it to you to the chat box. Yeah, please save that to your English learning list. <laughs> and then a little later, yeah, you can check and choose, write down on a sheet of paper what expressions you would like to use if you would like to add your own expressions. Okay, so we will be going here. Yeah. And before we are going to read this, I would like to ask you about Mr. Buhari's uh, discussion in your speaking practice through chat. Yeah, I will ask. Let's start with Haura. Yeah. There's a very interesting for me. Yeah. Really interesting topic that he has given. What is that? Which is much more be better like eating by using hand or spoon? <laughs> yeah. I get really interested with the discussion. What can you say about that, Haura? 
Hello. Um, okay. Hello. Well, I think I used to use my hand if I'm in my house, but mm -hmm. I will use spoon if it in restaurant or other people house. Mm, okay. So it's it's a meeting with other people, stranger or something, friends. I will use spoon, but in my family we use hand. Uh, it. Is it every day? Yeah. Wow. Yes. Except we eat with soup, maybe. Ah, of course. We use spoon. Uh -uh. Thank you so much, Hara. Yeah. Yeah. That's amazing. Perfect. Okay. And how about Fadley? How do you pronounce your name? Please correct me. Uh, <laughs> Hi, Fadley. Good um, evening to you. Yeah, good evening, Miss uh, Maris, Maris Chris. I'm yes. sorry for being late. Oh, it's okay. Yes, uh, can you explain uh, yeah. what Mr. we are Buhar's talking about? Mr. discussion, it's about which is better for you to, to or much more comfortable to use oh, spoon, using spoon or uh, eating using by your hand. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I believe uh, many Southeast Asian countries use hand, right? It's part of the cultures. So, I'm a left yeah, I think. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you, so you use so you use left hand for it i use a yes, right hand <laughs> yes uh, yeah, left-handed but, but this okay but yeah but this that that's okay um yeah so i i prefer use um right hand for mm -hmm. it and sometimes i use spoon because um uh we, we cannot use only hand right mm -hmm. uh, it depends on what kind of food it, it is like if we eat soup like um, Miss Hawa uh, mentioned it before. Mm -hmm. Of course, we cannot use hand, right? <laughs> because you can eat the 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 soup. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah. of course. Yeah. That's pretty gross, right? Eat it with your yeah. hands and soup. <laughs> I eat also with by hand yes, sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry but to intrude. Think, yeah, but that's okay, right? Um, in my belief or my religion, use hand is part of um kind. Uh. So you, yeah. you have a more value if you use hand mm. to eat. But but back um, uh, um, to what kind of the food, right? So if yes. you eat some uh, soup, um, you cannot use hand, you use spoon. Yes, that's really true. Wow, thank you so much for yeah. sharing, Hadley. <laughs> it's amazing because yeah, I so didn't know that. It's me. part of the culture. Yes. Yeah, yeah. In Southeast Asian country, I think uh, using hand for it is part of the cultures. So many tribes in Indonesia um, use hand for it. For eating. Oh, I yeah, see. Yeah, for eating. Wow, that's amazing. I'm afraid to eat yeah. by hand because I can eat a lot of rice. <laughs> and it's very dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Of course, we, we, we used to um, wash our hand first. Oh, yes, of keep course. Our, yeah, I, keep our hand hygiene uh -uh. and we can eat. Yes. Yes. Yeah, I, I like that saying, but I'm afraid to eat a lot of rice. You get it. <laughs> yeah, Thank yeah. you, Fadley. Yes, for sharing. That was okay. amazing. And next Thank one. Thank you so much for listening. The same con I mean, topic from Mr. Buhari's topic. Yeah. Who would like to try? Uh, why no? Would you like to try? Yes. Hi. Good evening. Good evening, Alpha. Yes. Why no? Thank you. Yeah, would you like to say something about that? Okay, I will go back to you later. How about Alpha? Yes, what can you say yeah. about Mr. Buhari's uh, topic? Yes, eating using your hand or by spoon? Maybe okay. in... In my for me, we often use hand because ah, okay. it's more comfortable. Mm -hmm. And when we use spoon when we eat rice, maybe nado and soup, just like okay. Hawa and Fatli. 
Uh, these special dishes. Wow. Thank you so much, Alpha. Yes. Uh, it's very interesting also for me to know this. Yeah. And I would like you to practice what you know, what you have already know in your uh, culture. And you would like to express this. And how about Iwan? Yeah. Can you tell something about that? Yes, Iwan? You can unmute also. Yeah, thank you. Uh, about uh, to, to eat with use. Uh, using. Spoon. Yeah, using. Oh, Don't yeah. forget using. It's a present. Using. using. Perfect. Uh -uh. Okay. I, I, I prefer using spoon. Ah, oh, okay. When I, when I eat, yes. Because uh, it's uh, my habit. Uh -uh. You uh, have it from uh, yeah when I was a child and until now mm -mm. I don't I don't comfort with I don't use spoon yes ah uh, you are not comfortable if you don't use spoon and fork yes yes hey uh, okay. yeah thank you so that everyone will knows also how about a uh, how rod did I ask you yeah I'm the first. Yes, thank you. Hmm? And how about why no? Yes, you're the last. Seize this kind of opportunity for you to speak out. Okay, Miss. Uh, about the statement, according to my experience, yes. I often use my hand, mm -hmm. but uh, the most import important thing when we eat, yes. we keep etiquette of eating mm -mm, sometimes we use our hand and sometimes we use uh, our spoon mm -mm. for example when we eat uh, soup like noodles uh, like soto do you know soto soto i don't know <laughs> yes so yeah like uh like it's like kind soup. of soup uh soup. Ah, a kind yes. of soup can i check yeah. like that soto yes Yes. Soto, soto ayam. Soto. Yeah. Yes. Oh, right. soto, yes. soto ayam. ayam. Okay, let me check. Soto yes. ayam. Soto. Ah, you can look it. Wow. Uh, I used to like very use delicious. Uh, like a ramen. Spoon. Yes. Of I course. cannot imagine uh, when we eat soup and we use our hand. Mm -hmm, I think it is it. very difficult for us. Yeah. yeah. Ah, okay. Yes, wow. This is very delicious. Do you use chopsticks? Chopsticks. Uh, I, I don't. Do you? Uh, I never. I I have never used used them. Ah, you have never used them. Wow. Yes. I guess it's spork. much more enjoyable. Yes, Alpha. Maybe because we, we use fork in Indonesia. Yeah. Ah, yes. okay. Wow, it's very interesting. What's the name? Sumpit, sumpit, yeah. Yes, it helps. <laughs> What? The, what? The I lost. Sumpit in Indonesian language. Ah, sumpit, sumpit. <laughs> yes, sumpit. It's called sumpit. Ah, okay. That looks a little spicy and ramen. Yeah, I believe you know ramen, different types of ramen, mm -hmm. tonkatsu ramen, Japanese food. Yeah, those dishes. I've never tasted any Indonesian cuisine. Maybe if I had, I've uh, tasted how to call wadang tahu. You know, wadang tahu. Yes. Yes, wadang tahu. Of course, I really like wedang this. Jahe, wedang jahe. <laughs> yeah, I like strawberry one. Yeah. Strawberry. Strawberry wadang tahu. Do you want oh. to see our tahu in the Philippines? What tahu tahu? <laughs> Sorry. Okay, I, I just want to show you. Yeah, this is the tahu, our tahu in the Philippines. Tahu. Tahu. Street food. Oh. Yes, in the Philippines. It's pretty Street common food. to eat. Yeah, very delicious. Yeah, this is the very yeah. oh, is, is fruits, fruits, miss? Fruits. Yes, it's a strawberry flavor. Oh, strawberry. strawberry. Tahu, if you will visit in my country, we have varieties of flavor. Caramel, 
uh, ube and also Spare, strawberry. It's very, it's very delicious, I think. Yes. Is it the same in your country? No, uh, in, in my country, is ice cream, ice cream. Ah, ice cream. Oh. Ah, okay. Like yeah, it's a kind of it, delicacy. Yes, Alpha? In my country, it's look like chendol. Chendol. Gendong. Yes. Gendong. Okay. Uh, literally. Gendong. Gendong. C E N D O L. C E N D. N D O. Gendong. Yeah. yeah. Like this. Yes. 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 Yeah. Ah, that's, okay. Yeah. That's gendong. Gendong. Ah, this is gendong. I will tell to my friend from Jakarta too. Ah, this one. This is gendong. <laughs> this is gendong. It looks like crusted ice, isn't it? Is it a crusted ice? Yes. Grand yes. crusted ice. Oh, wow. And, and what is the green oil. one? What is this? The green the one. The green one is uh, it's like, a, like a noodle. It's Noodles? It's wow. Ah, okay. Maybe I know. Yes. Like a noodle, but the taste it's... is sweet, miss. Ah, okay. Wow. Maybe I know it looks like a tapioca. Do you yes, know? Maybe. Yeah, tapioca. Yeah. It yes, it's like from a... tapioca and mm. the green is from pandan leaf. Ah, pandan leaf. Okay, wow. So the smell is good if it's yes, pandan it's so leaf. Good. Okay, thank you. So this is one of my favorite mango. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, let's proceed now to our lesson topics. Yeah. Okay. Okay, and when we are talking about emails, we have a tons of expressions we would like to share. Like open lines, yeah, for example, open being line. social. All right. In this socialization, your greetings is much more upgraded. Last time we discussed pretty like the starting the starter when we are emailing other people but now it's much more formal and you know business areas when you are sending an email whether from the socials box, and the like so i have prepared here yes alpha can you read this part at first thank you until here okay i hope you had a good weekend yes Thank you. Please continue. I hope you had a great, a great trip. Hope you had nice break. I hope you are well. I hope all is well. Hope you are enjoying your holiday. I hope this email finds you well. I hope you enjoyed the event. I'm glad we had the chance to chat at the con at the at the convention. Mm -hmm. It was great to see you on Thursday. It was a pleasure to meet you yesterday. Okay, thank you so much. Of course, while Alpha have read these kind of expressions, I would like to give you some areas which we could improve into our pronunciations. When we are sounding E and A, yes, we have to remember that it sounds long. Long E. Just long like e. you got a little deeper. Great. 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 great, yes. Great. I great. hope you had a great. great trip. Even though I sound a little monotone, I still have this tone because that's how we great. pronounce great. It, it's different, great. great or great. Which one do you like? I guess it changes the meaning if you say great. Great, great. Yeah, perfect, great. Iwan. Yes, that's right. Yeah, if alpha... Could read that could you it could be like this greet greet and great yeah you can see the difference if you make your voice a little deeper and upside great or greet it's a different meaning same yes. also of break right. the same break yeah break. just right. need to yes that's really true if you mispronounce that and has a, a little shorter sound, it becomes like brick. Break. Break. So it's different. Break and brick. Yeah. You really have to be careful also saying this. 
Mm. Yeah, how Beach. can you read? Beach. Um, one more time. Beach. Beach. Yeah, perfect. Beach. Yes, because mm. if you mispronounce it, it becomes like bitch. <laughs> oh, bitch, like that. That's not good, of course. Same also of this expression. Bitch. Bitch. What about this? Rich. 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 Yes. Rich. If you Rich. go to the supermarket and you cannot really reach that ball, what would you say? Rich. Excuse me. Could you please reach that for me? To reach. Huh? Yeah. They don't understand. Rich. Reach. Rich. Yes. Reach. Pretty long. Rich. Yes. Long Perfect. Reach. Rich. Yes. That's really true. Reach. Don't say rich. Don't yes. say rich. Not rich. rich. Yeah. Reach. Always rich. sound this. Long E sound. And then we also have rich. this. E, yeah, event, e event, 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 yeah. event. Yes, event. 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 I hope you event. enjoyed the event. Event. Yeah. The How about this event. one? Ple. Same as a pleasure. 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 Yes. That's Pleasure. right. It was pleasure to meet you yesterday. Pleasure. Yes. It was a pleasure, pleasure to, to meet, meet you yesterday. yesterday. Perfect. Okay. Pleasure. Yes. Because if you're going to learn pleasure. into, yes, in America, they also have the same thing. We have just two areas which we should improve, like long and short sound. Yeah, like E is a short sound and E and E, E and A is a long sound. Uh, this two, you have to keep in mind to have a little longer sound of this uh, part yeah, sure. because you will never get mistake here, okay? Next one, uh, here, what about... E1, can you read this? Thank okay. you. I'm, read, I'm, I'm writing to you about our last meeting. Your presentation yesterday. Our next event. Our next event. Uh huh. I'm, okay. I'm, I'm writing to you with regards to or regarding. Mm -hmm. Yes. Concern, concerning, concerning. Yes. In connection, in connection with. Yes, perfect. I'm writing to ask, to inquire, ask. Uh -huh. inquire, let you know, confirm. Confirm, check, like that. Co confirm. Yes. Check, invite you to, uh -huh. to update you on, to update you on. As for a fearful. Okay. Fearful. I'm writing you to follow up on. Okay. I'm contacting you to inform. Yes, correct. I'm reaching out because, because. Because, okay. Good. Because. Yes. Yeah, perfect. It sounds better. Because. because. Uh. This is just a quick note to. This one is quick. Quick note to quick. Yeah, note perfect. Two. Quick note. No, quick note. note. This is a just quick note. Perfect. This is this is just a quick reminder. Perfect. Mm -hmm. I wanted to let you know that. Uh -huh. Might I take a moment of your time too? Yeah, but you don't need to press might. Might I? My might I? Yeah. It might sounds. I, it doesn't sound stiff. Might I take a moment of your time to blah 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 like that? Might, might I take a moment of your time to? It's yes. your um, name. It's it's your name <laughs> from your company. Okay. This email is just to let you know that. All right. Thank you so much, Iwan. That was amazing. Now, while Iwan is reading the text, 
Yeah, I have checked also the pronunciation of him. Yeah, just like quick note. Quick. Confirm, note. especially don't say confirm because if you say this, you're don't gay. <laughs> oh, yeah. Confirm, do you know? It's a kind of expressions for gay. Confirm that you are a gay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Confirm. Confirm. Okay, okay. Confirm. Yeah, yes. Confirm. Yeah. Yes. In my country, if you say firm, that is uh, gay. Yeah. <laughs> and we say confirm. Thank Don't you. <laughs> yes. This is the same. And now we would like to reply somebody. What would you like to say? Uh, yeah. Sadly. Yeah, I believe you are good in here. Okay. This is for replying. Okay, then. Uh, and then you're going to read it. We would like to check your pronunciation. Okay, sure, sure. And tell me which one do you use as often. Okay. Ready? Okay. I, I'm ready. Um, I just got your request for... Is it okay? Yes, perfect. Okay, I will continue. I just yes. read your email about, is it thank okay? You. Perfect. Okay. okay, thank you. As we discussed, I would like to send you. Okay. Thank you for your email about. Mm -hmm. Just continue. Thanks for, okay. Thanks for your email this morning, yesterday, on Wednesday, last month. Okay, last month. Last yes. month. Last month. Yes, that's months. right. Months. Sometimes students say last months like that. They say months, but I don't know. It sounds months. months only. Months or months. Months. Without without vibration. It's a unvoiced sound oh. with your th. Months. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Months. Okay. Months. Yes, that's right. We have. Okay. Two parts of TH sound. With vibration, you can point your, uh, your hands to your throat. Zzz, and non-vibration. For example, uh, with vibration. That. Thus. The. That. Okay. Yes. <clears throat> this. With this, vibration. But or TH without vibration, like must. Sex, must. Thank. Thank. Yes, that's Thank. right. You can also try yeah. and check to your, yeah, for, you know, <clears throat> men, Adam's apple, which your vibration comes from your throat, okay, to your vocal cords. Next, Fadley. Um, okay, okay. Thanks for your feedback on your invitation or your suggestion. Okay, right, perfect. Thanks for sending, asking about attending. Okay, thank you. Uh, you may say like send, sending, sending. Sending. Okay, sending. Thanks for sending. Attending. attending. Okay. Please con continue. Thanks for your quick reply. Yes, thank you. Thanks for getting back to me so quickly. Yeah. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you for reaching out. Yes, to me. thank you. Yeah, reaching out, reaching out to me. And uh, I like your reading also, Fadley, because you thank read you so really much. well. <laughs> yeah, it was great. Yeah. And yeah, which one do you, you often use? Um, for replying email. Um, yes. I think the last one. The last thank one? Thank you for reaching me out. Ah, okay. Thank you That's for all. reaching out about <laughs> reaching out yeah, to okay. me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes, of course. That is pretty native. If you use reaching out, we often use that. What well, thanks for your reply. For me, I often use, yeah. Um, yeah. In, I just read your email, your email about. Email. Yes, that's yeah, really true. I just read your email about. Thanks for your email this morning. Mm -hmm. Thanks for your feedback.